debut that nearly wasn't. <laughs> um, yeah, it was uh, well, a week Thursday ago where my last spa, my last round, I uh, pulled my shoulder really bad. I had to go to the hospital to get it checked out. Yeah. Um, I was going to pull out, uh, but literally we know, this sounds a bit big headed, but how good my jab is. And I knew I'm very skilled through my pedigree uh, you, to stay out you, of trouble. Did you know about your opponent though? Because he's like six foot eight, wasn't he? We were going to get a smaller. Uh, it was. It was. A, he had him first, then we got a small opponent, and I thought the small opponent's easy because just with the jab, it's easy. Yeah. I've got to reach on him. I won't have to reach him in my right. But then we got ended up with a six foot nine guy who was mm. dangly. And then I thought, all right, well, I'm going to have to double up my jab, which I did. Um, and I just had to be smart. It was frustrating because... I, I was going to say, because mm. I was watching, I watched mm. the last round and a half, and I was a little bit frustrated because I felt yeah. there was so much more to give. Yeah, and yeah, as yeah. soon as you told me then, I went, ah, yeah. oh, right, you know, because yeah. you just skated it what, a week ago, was well, it? Well, yeah, well, a week Thursday ago, a week Thursday ago, and, I, and I'm boxing mm. <laughs> a week later. Do you know what I mean? I did it on my left shoulder, I've had it up, but it's fantastic, oh, obviously. Yeah, yeah. Um, I've just been very unlucky. I'm, I'm going to see how it is and then see a specialist and then uh, just, just go on. But I really enjoyed it. I, I, when I was in like first, I knew it was quite simple because he was, he was so obvious what, what, th job, uh, what shots he was going to throw. Yeah. Um, yeah, so I started to really enjoy it with all the... Uh, well, I, I was pleasantly surprised because I, obviously when I came down to interview at the gym, yeah. uh, you were all dressed and there was no pads, so I never really got a chance to see you back yeah, in the yeah, bag yeah. or anything like that. Yeah. And so I wasn't sure what to expect. I knew yeah. I was going to expect a nice boxer because yeah. you don't get GB England no, no. You know, and win 19 out of 24 fights yeah, yeah, if you're yeah, not yeah. a nice boxer. No, no. But I was surprised of... Yeah. You know, when you told me you weighed in at 14 stone one, yeah, yeah. I, I was really surprised because you're thick set, I know, you're, not, I know. you're six foot five nearly, know, yeah, so, and yeah, you're, exactly. you're built like a brick shit house. Yeah. And I was thinking, yeah, yeah. I thought you might look like your opponent because yeah. he was six foot eight and yeah, really yeah. skinny and lightweight, yeah, yeah. but you're not. It, I, that's just because all I do is just training. When I'm not boxing, I'm training. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? I, I don't go up, I don't go down, um, and I'm always staying fit, I'm always in the gym. Um, and it's just I've done it like I said since I was like three years old. Um, but yeah. What were you going to find out about this? You got to go and see a specialist or something. I'm going to see a specialist. Uh, fingers crossed. It's not not too bad. There's no chipping on the bone or anything. And then mm -hmm. I can just do loads of rehab on it and get and get it done. But just imagine if I'm a right hand. He was there to be hit, and I, and I had to pull back every time I was throwing it, which is frustrating. But um, Robbie Butler, my coach, and their D target, they, they thought of a plan, and it was just simple: mm -hmm. double up the jab, a jab hook, and. Um, when the rights are available, hit it, but just just pull it each time. Do you know what I mean? I just stay busy. It was 436, um, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, for yeah, every yeah, round. Yeah, 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 I, yeah. I think I've run it every round quite quite simple. Well, I, I, um, I didn't see the first two rounds mm, and I didn't see the result. Yeah. Because uh, I came in here to do an interview. Yeah. But um, no, like you say, I was a little bit frustrated. And then when I met you on the stairs, yeah, yeah, yeah. you said to me, I don't yeah, yeah. Sean, had Steve not told yeah, yeah. me. Well, he never tells me anything. Yeah. <laughs> I just want to find things out on, yeah. on my own. But yeah. uh, it was nice because, like you say, I was impressed with what you were doing, yeah, um, yeah. but I just wanted to see more of it, and yeah. now I understand. Yeah, so. definitely. Um, I'm more frustrated than anybody because uh, the guys are, you know, I've been in. I, even, I know it's amateur, but the guys have been in the ring, even sparring when I went out to London. Do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Ten times better, ten times bigger heavyweights, all the rest of it. Um, Eighteen stone. Do you know what I mean? Do you and, feel? I'm pushing them back, and, and yeah. I'm just, it's so frustrating. Would well, you feel that like because of your uh, the caliber of the people that you've been moving around with yeah. from? Uh, yeah, amateur days. Mm. Do you feel if your yeah, injury's not too bad and everything yeah. goes well, you could move through this quite quickly? Yeah, I, I think so. I, I, I'm, that, that was it. That sounds big. That was easy. I started to enjoy it. Well, it, it, looked, just, it looked yeah. easy. That's why it yeah, looked yeah, frustrating yeah. because yeah, it looked yeah. too easy. Yeah, yeah. And I was thinking, why you're not doing yeah, yeah. more? And then obviously you explain why you're not doing more because yeah. you know you dislocated your arm. And the, the defense that I was working, with, Robert, I, I could see every time he was going to come in, he was uh, he was jump in before he was doing anything. So it was simple, especially my pedigree. Do you know what I mean? I knew everything he was going to do before he was going to do it. And uh, the right hooks, he was just trying to loop in. And his jab was so weak, it, was, it wasn't... But it was an exciting night tonight for the yeah. cruiserweights on this show yeah. because we had young Nathan Quarles, who yeah. uh, looked really good. He had to keep one for yeah, yeah. 36. Yeah, yeah. Um, and then we had Jay Farrell, who looked yeah. like an animal when he stopped the kid. Yeah, yeah, you know, good, yeah, yeah. These are all exciting possibilities yeah, yeah, down in the, the future, line, yeah, yeah. You're, you're hoping to bypass all these kids yeah. and move straight into the deep end yeah, if yeah. everything goes well yeah, definitely. early next year. Without, without a doubt, without a doubt. Um, but you can see how big I am and how easy I made the weight. I've got a massive frame, I'm fit as a fit. 
pausing and blowing it all around. No, yeah. And, li and I can listen well, to it. Well, that's why it's for sure yeah, yeah. as well, because I'm seeing yeah. why you're not doing more when, when you know... I'm and, I, and I didn't want to tell people, because they think, I don't want to tell people shoulder injury, weakness and all the rest of it. But I thought, I have to tell people. Yeah, because yeah. Pe and even uh, people in the old days would be like, I know Mike, where's the uppercuts, where's the hooks, do you know what yeah. I mean? But I just showed I could beat someone with one arm, literally, and that's exactly what I did. And, and it's my defences. That, that's alright if you had 10 or 15 fights behind you, yeah. going out and doing that. Yeah. But on your debut, that's yeah. extra special really, to be able to mm. perform mm. like that, on your debut, when yeah. you know you're carrying an injury, yeah, and definitely. a pretty serious injury. Yeah, so... It was, uh, well, uh, but they gave me a lot of confidence and everything, so it's, uh, and, and they, they're my trainers, and... Do you know what? I know, you know they've stuck by me through this other uh, injury, and mm -hmm. they've they know they've seen me, they've seen me in spars against you know, top kids, and they see, they see how good I am, and how talented I am, and they've stood by me. Uh, to, literally, they've stood by me for two years training me. Do you mm -hmm. know what I mean? No money, asked for them or anything. No, and, no, everyone knows. Do you know, no do you, money in this game. Do you, yeah, do you, no. do, but, but yeah, they, they, they didn't have to. Money. They could have gone, listen, mate, you're getting injured. See you later. Do you yeah. know what I mean? And they stood by me, and because they, they they know how, how good I am, and. It's just I enjoyed it. I wasn't really that nervous. Do you know what mm -hmm. I mean? I was enjoying the crowd, and it was it was it was quite it was quite simple, and the whole atmosphere and everything was great. And I've got to do that again. <laughs> <laughs> well, hopefully it's going to be soon. Yeah. So we'll find out about that, and hopefully you yeah. may be in return here because I think we've got a show here, yeah. BT convention on May twelfth, yeah, yeah. where Brogan's doing his uh, Central Area title fight. Yeah. Well, I, 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 with tickets, I saw uh, nearly 150 tickets. I, I didn't yeah. really push it. Do you know what I mean? And uh, there's loads of people that I dropped out, and it was uh, I've got a lot of people in Warrington that uh, didn't come as well. That was my old uh, amateur gym as well. Um, but no, it's, it just felt good. It felt yeah. really good. Everything was uh, relaxed. I work off the jab, double jab, le left hook, throw the right to the body, jab to there, jab to the body, and that's all I did. And it was <laughs> simple. Um, it was frustrating because he was on the ropes, and I knew he was there to get hit, and yeah. I had to hit him, and then I knew he was dazed, but I couldn't follow in it, uh, no. for when it was so frustrating, and there was the uppercut there, and the right hook, I threw a nice right hook, and I caught him nice, but then I pulled it, and I thought, I thought, oh, I've got to pull back on that, so, but it's given me so much confidence to, yeah. to think I've done that with uh, literally one arm, um, and yeah, Steve Woods as well, thank him for putting me on the show. Yeah, no, it's uh, been a great show so far. Everything. Great yeah. show so far. Hopefully, so, next yeah. time I come down to ride out, maybe we'll catch you on the bikes yeah, yeah, with the lads. Yeah, on the bikes and, and everything. So uh, get this sorted, and next time I want to um, show a bit more. Well, let me uh, say this anyway. Congratulations, Mike. One and all. <laughs> Take care, mate. Thank you very See much. You See bye, -bye. Yeah, bye bye. Bye bye.